and today we are making another Warrior Cats Ultimate Edition video. In today's video, the game is finally on full release, or, you know, it's out there. <laughs> you can now play it for free, you do not have to do pay, unless, you know, you want to buy game passes, and you, you do have to pay for those, but it is now free to play. <laughs> it was released out yesterday. Again, I missed it, but of everybody who was a part of it, I do believe got a badge for that, and that means if you got the badge, then boom, you're special, because <laughs> I don't think you can get that badge ever again. I mean, I don't see how you could, but <laughs> you know, uh, but yeah, you got a badge, and I'm not entirely sure if anything else really happened at that time. I mean, maybe something else popped up, but I, I really don't know. They just said something was going Going to happen again i don't know if that meant badge or maybe just something else not entirely sure <laughs> but now we are going to play the game we're gonna check out if anything new has been changed like if anything has been changed or not because i can already see that trees look a bit different places are looking a bit different obviously this loading screen is a lot different you can you can see that but we're gonna we're gonna play this we're gonna check it out and we're gonna see we're going to see. <gasps> we can't roleplay. Entering editor. Oh my gosh. <gasps> Whoa. Tutorial character editor. Welcome to the character editor. This is where you can customize your cat with colors and accessories. Oh my gosh. Tutorial left panel. You can change your cat's color using the left panel. Each category changes colors on different parts of the cat. Yo, us beta testers, we're going to be pros at this. <laughs> Anybody new? They're going to be like, how do I do this? <laughs> oh, you can also use a paintbrush setting to color individual parts for maximum detail. <gasps> that wasn't there before. Oh, I like that. I like that a lot. That was going to make it so much easier on me personally because... God, I am just so incredibly d bad at doing, like, this thing, so... <laughs> uh, I, it looks like they definitely changed it, though, to make it look easier, like... Or, you know, I think there's, like, you can go into... You can't go into, like, full detail through this thing, how you could before. But before, holy moly, <laughs> holy moly, there was a lot going on there. Um, accessories, accessories and markings for your cat are... So sorted in this panel here there are lots of options there are a lot of <laughs> options um tutorial age you can use the slider to change the age of your cat you know uh finished character you can click finish when you are done to enter the game world or maybe make sure you save it first <laughs> you know just just saying i mean you definitely would probably want to do that of all things so Okay, advanced is how it was at first, you know? This was how we all saw it when we before, you know? Before everything changed, this is how it was originally set up. But they made it simple now, which I really like that because that definitely helps me out because I do really like the advanced because I think you can get really crazy with that. But at the same time, sometimes I just want to make a simple cat and it just gets so difficult when all you have the option for is advanced. And I just, I take so long already. So I just, oh my goodness. <laughs> I feel like the morph like looks different. Is it just me or does the... Like, it's, it's the same kind of shape, but I feel like the eyes, first of all, eyes are definitely different because they're shaded now, which I, I got that. <laughs> but I don't know, I feel like it's something other than the eyes. Maybe it is just the eyes. The eyes are, like, really throwing me off, maybe. I feel like the eyes definitely look really better like that. I honestly really like that. That looks so cool. All the pictures, when you, like, swipe through when you click on the game, oh my gosh, they look so nice. <laughs> And it's all with just cats in the game. It's just aww. And then we all get to keep our lovely accessories from before. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, there's a, a star scarf. Sage. Okay, so there is... There's another badge you can get, this one, but I'm not entirely sure how you get that one. We'll definitely probably figure that out at some point, but you know, for now, I'm not entirely sure. Why is this one locked? Oh, right. <laughs> you gotta, you've got to pay for that one. Okay, so we can click through, pick our size. What is codes? You can enter codes? <gasps> what? There's codes in this game now? Ooh, guys, codes. All right, anyways, though, we're not gonna, like, 
waste time making a cat model this time because we already know if you see me play this game before i'm incredibly slow at making like <laughs> these characters and so you know usually i'll make like a specific video for that or i'll just make one in my own time so you know i'm definitely going to have to make one at some point because all mine are oh god <laughs> but it's okay it's okay because we can make new ones all right anyways we want to check the map though that's what well, that's what's important building character <gasps> put together my character oh Ooh. oh my gosh what the heck <gasps> guys guys what what this game looks so cool now <laughs> oh my gosh okay i'm gonna go to the houses first you know i want to see the houses i want to see what's happened here the hud the hud <laughs> the bottom hud buttons can be used to change clans go back to the editor and much more the hud <laughs> this menu lets you edit information about your character such as your name and description for example you can check out animation sitting sleeping etc in this menu <gasps> oh my gosh if you want to change your clan and allegiance go to the other locations or see a map you can open this menu feel free to explore the other menus or return to the character editor with this button oh my oh my goodness <laughs> what how did i do that i press q oh <laughs> um do i have to turn off shift lock hold on let me check oh yeah okay i always forget like not to have shift lock on in most animal games oh my goodness it looks so different whoa look at this i can like crouch oh my gosh i'm a sneaky kitty ah. <laughs> it's kind of funny because i'm like i have a cat of my own and it's just oh my god yo this house this house is looking crazy whoa <laughs> i love this so much this looks so cool look at that there's whoa <laughs> Whoa! Oh my gosh, guys! I am my mind is being blown right now. Can you actually go upstairs? <gasps> Monkey! <laughs> can you actually go upstairs now? <gasps> you can actually go upstairs, guys! I love the house. Cat plushie! <laughs> oh my gosh! Wolves? <laughs> Wolves? What? Oh! <laughs> okay. Oh, and then these doors don't go anywhere. Okay. Okay. And another room. Oh my gosh! These are so cool. Oh my gosh! <laughs> Um, hello sheep. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know what I'm doing here, but hi. Dude, this game looks so insanely cool right now. Oh, I love this so much. Okay, we gotta- I don't know if I'm gonna be able to explore this entire map. This- Ah! <laughs> Are the other houses not- you- like, can you go in the other ones? Okay, I'm gonna assume most of these houses, like all the other ones, you can't- <gasps> I've touched world border. You've reached the world border. The area outside this border cannot be accessed. Sorry. Well, thank you for informing me. Because I probably would have tried for about 20 minutes to get over there. Only to realize I can't get over there. <laughs> you know? I, I, I do that sometimes. Okay. So, yeah. Most of these other houses, you can't go inside. It's only this one. But I like that house a lot. I think that's really cool that they at least changed it. So, you can go into more spots. We've got a lot of wood. This map seems like it got a whole lot bigger. Oh my gosh. We've got a bridge. Can I not go? Am I still? Is this the world border? Still. Oh goodness. Look at the little wind effect. <laughs> oh my gosh. That's so cool. Discoveries. You just made a discovery. You can check it out in this menu. Explore the world to discover more. Whoa. <gasps> Resources. <gasps> Hello. Cat. Oh my goodness. Okay, so you can <gasps> lore. <laughs> so there's a lot of stuff you can get. So I believe though, okay, I'm just gonna assume, but I'm not entirely sure. But because I know about that sage badge, or at least that's what I believe it's called. So I think once you unlock all the secrets around the map here, that's what unlocks that accessory and the badge. Now again, I'm not entirely sure, but that's what I'm kind of assuming goes on there because, you know, I don't... <laughs> Uh, that's at least like that's what it made it sound like oh oh my gosh i am swimming <laughs> how do i get out i want out please <laughs> i made another discovery so you know if you want to make discoveries i guess basically run around the map explore you know make sure you reach every part of the map and then also just pick up anything that you can pick up i wonder can you pick up like or do anything with the beehives <gasps> 
get rid of the beehives? <laughs> I just realized that that might be a possibility. The fact that they could have just they got rid of the beehives. Maybe. I think they did. Possibly. I'm not sure. Uh, let's go over here. Oh, we're in Shadow Clan territory. I want to go over here, though, because I'm not going to really check out the clans because I can kind of imagine what they look like just based off from before. But I want to check out the buildings specifically because, you know, I can definitely tell that these places have been changed. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm gonna just pick up stuff along the way. So we got this little storage area. Nothing in here. No secrets. We've got spider web. Oh, <gasps> yoink. <laughs> All right, let's quickly go over here too because I just want to see if they possibly left the secret hole alongside the mountain or maybe they moved it you know you don't know really <laughs> you could have either moved it or it's still there somewhere i mean who knows <gasps> hole <laughs> it's still here oh no <laughs> it splits off into two okay this one leads to the wonderful lovely crystal i'm surprised that this doesn't count as a discovery maybe because this isn't actually like a part of anything this is just kind of like for fun you know but I like this thing a lot. I love this crystal. That room's so nice. All right, let me check out the other side, though. What's on the other side? A darker crystal? Oh, nope, a hole. <laughs> it doesn't go anywhere. Okay. Well, at least we know the secret hole is still there down by the mountain. For any new people who want to play, you know, or are playing and you want to know about the secret hole there there it is wind clan oh my gosh i remember spending a long time in wind clan for a role play <laughs> all right hold on i gotta can i jump over the fence there we go okay we got the barn i saw that the barn looked really different i like the barn i feel like it's really cool that there's a lot more in it now and i like that the boxes are stacked to create like a staircase to get up here oh my gosh that's so cool i love the barn the barn's probably gotta be my favorite spot so far i mean i did really like the house because there was a lot going on in the house but you know barn really cool in my opinion <laughs> oh my gosh this place is humongous and we still got that other house all the way over there i have to go oh my gosh would like to give the current character design wait would like to give you the current i mean sure i guess <laughs> i mean I don't have a character design right now, and if you really want to give me your character design, I mean, I might just take it. Oh! Whoa! <laughs> Whoa, this is a crazy character design. I like this. Thank you. <laughs> Can I just have this now? Um, you know, I'm just gonna chill with it for the rest of the video, you know? I think it's really cool that you can just go around with, like, a blank kind of base, and then someone can just offer you their character design. That's really cool, in my opinion. Like, look, I am, like, a really cool-looking cat right now. <laughs> I am so nice-looking. Oh, I love this. Thank you, whoever just gave that to me. <laughs> I don't even know if you watch my videos, but I mean, oh my gosh, I've got your morph now. All right, we've got this house over here, but you cannot go in it. Anything else? I think it's just the clans that we'd have to check out, but again, probably not gonna do that, but uh, <laughs> I'll definitely make sure to inform you guys if there are any other updates. I mean, we'll definitely probably in another video on this game check out the actual territory areas and then also maybe make a few different cat designs and show you there or maybe just create one you know either way and maybe if we find a code along the way i'll also make sure to get that too but that's going to be it for this video if you guys like this video make sure to leave a like subscribe to be part of life squad and i'll see you guys in the next video bye